Okay, and we're... Oh, and nobody wants to talk. Yeah, I know about Nocturne of Shadow, but instead we're going to be doing this part. Gerudo Fortress! <clears throat> now, there's two ways to get in. Is If you've got a Pona, which I don't on this playthrough yet, you can just actually jump the gap. You actually get like a whole cutscene and everything. It's pretty cool. Or you can just hook shot across like I just did, but you need a long shot. I actually, you know what? While I'm here... Save a little bit of clean up later. <laughs> so I actually have to come back here anyway for one of the for the trading quest, don't I? Ah, it saves me a little bit of time. Just get his gold sculpture loose. Oh my control is vibrating. <laughs> oh, there's a secret around here. But I don't need it because I don't remember this one. Actually, I'm curious what this one is then. So that's one full rupees, so I don't remember. Oh, it is Summer Storms, nice. First time guess. Oh no, it's a, it's a good one. Okay. That's what you've got. Ah, it's a potion top up one. Topped up potions. Yeah, red and green. I don't need them. Anyway, <laughs> back on what we're actually what we're actually here for. The stealth section of the game. Well, the other one, because we had the castle, but that one was quite short. Luckily, I can make as much noise as I want. I still remember I kept getting caught when I was doing this as a kid, so I just got so frustrated I just shot one out of annoyance. And then it actually turns out you can do that. It was hilarious. I didn't actually know you could. Over here inside the cell. I have no idea where you come from, but you must have a lot of guts to make it past all the guards around here. All my fellow carpenters are imprisoned somewhere in here. <coughs> if you can get us out of here, we'll repay the favor somehow. But be careful, there's sure to be Gerudo guards somewhere around here. Whoa, watch out! Come on, why is it so hard to lock on on this game? <laughs> this is not a very efficient method. <laughs> Pinder in the corner with arrows. That'll do. I've only got about six left, but whatever. <sighs> Why can I not hit a pot? <laughs> what the heck is he doing? Like some weird dance. Oh, right, I have to open the cell. I'm here trying to talk to him. <laughs> Did you come here and save me? Well, that's just swell. I'm Ichiro the Carpenter. We were really interested in joining their all-female group, but they locked us up like this just because we're men. We don't care about the Gerudo anymore. That's so rude. Three of my fellows have also been captured, so please help them escape too. 
So yeah, I think I was supposed to speak to the head carpenter for background on information on this, but yeah, we're basically busting a whole bunch of male carpenters out of an all-female tribe. Oh, hey. Next door right ahead. And... Okay, there is someone. <laughs> Play it safe. Yeah, finding that out by accident before. <laughs> well, more frustration than accident. I just shot one. He's like, oh wait, that works? Okay. <laughs> and then just proceeded to shoot every single one of them. Over there inside the cell. I have no idea. Uh, this is the same thing, isn't it? Yep. Fellow carpenters in prison. Get us out of here. We pay favor. Careful, show those guards. Blah blah blah. That being said, I do remember Deku not works well, I believe. Actually, we don't use fire arrows yet. We should do that. Okay, let's see if we can lock on this time. Nope. Nope. That's not locking on. There we go. Uh. Oh, I forgot the fire rate is so slow on this. The fire rate of fire arrows. Screw it, nuts. You wait for that, then not them. That's the more ammo friendly method. I'm tempted just to do the Begore on side quests just so it doesn't take so many hits. <laughs> Anyway, it's two now. You are free now! Run! You're a cute kid, what? I'm Juro the Carpenter. <coughs> These women are so scary, I'd rather work as a carpenter than join them. I can't wait to say goodbye to this place. Two of my buddies are still being held prisoner. Will you please get them out too? How does he know, like, one of them's already been freed? Like, seriously, how do these guys know that? Hi, I'm just going to go ahead and assume that you freed, like, that exactly four of us were taken, and exactly one of us so far has been freed. Like, the first guy can get off the hook, because he has no idea whether you've rescued the others or not, but... That guy? Also, there's vines here. I forget why. Uh, which way do we go now? There's two doors. That's why I should probably take off the fire effects so I can fire quicker. I love how this other guy, other one is not alerted at all by the fact that one of them just got shot. They're just sleeping. Oh, 
Hello. Do, 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 do. Um. Yeah, there's no one up here. Oh, 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 I know that. Let's get this while we're here. So it's the entire point of that area, that sculpture. That seems to be all you get out of coming this way. It's just the sculpture and the heart piece. Um... Oh no, I think I can drop down here, can't I? This looks like the way we're forward. on again. I'm going to end up doing this entire fight without being locked on at this rate. There we go. Come on. Come on, we both know you're going to do it. Thanks, boy. You're fantastic. I'm Saburu, the carpenter. Have you seen our boss, boy? He's probably worried about me. I have to get back to him immediately. One or more of our workers is still a prisoner. I think this was supposed to be the last one, because this is like a dead end. <coughs> I think I was supposed to drop down at them vines. <coughs> it's either that, that room that I turned around at, or the vines I was supposed to climb down. Also, I don't know how far this guard goes. So I'm probably going to get caught here. That guard cannot still be unconscious. What? 
What? How long are you going to sleep for? Wow, okay. <laughs> I thought they got up after a while. So where's the one with the vine? Oh, it's right here, okay. Oh wow, yeah, this is it. <laughs> I went straight past it. So what's that way then? Oh, an exit. It's a shame I've only got six hours now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, same routine. All my fellow carpenters, blah blah blah. If it goes out, blah blah blah. We're very favor. Very careful. Let's show you guys. Somewhere around here, blah blah blah. Watch out. Quite small. A bit worried that they're going to land a lucky hit. Okay, you should be the last one then. I was afraid you were going to forget about me. Now I'm free. I'm sure the carpenter. For rescuing me, I'll tell you something interesting about the desert that I overheard the Gerudos talking about. They said in order to cross the haunted wasteland, you'll need the Eye of Truth. The Colossus is on the far side of the wasteland. Okay, now I'm going back to my tent near Gerudo Valley, so drop by sometime. You may find something helpful there. <clears throat> I've seen your fine work. To get past the guards here, you must have good thieving skills. I didn't thieve anything. Well, I guess I kind of took the keys, but that's more mugging. That's more of a mugging. I used to think that all men besides the great Ganondorf were useless. But now that I've seen you, I don't think so anymore. The exalted Naburu, our leader, had put me in charge of this fortress. Naburu is the second in command to the great Ganondorf, king of the Gerudo thieves. Her headquarters are in the Spirit Temple, which is at the end of the desert. Say, you must want to become one of us, eh? Alright then, you're in from now on. Take this, with it, you'll have free access to all areas of the fortress. You will obtain the Gerudo membership card. You can get into the Gerudo training ground in their hideout. They may be an honorary woman. Hi, Gerudo. No, I can't knock him out anymore. <laughs> eh. I'm kind of curious what was in that room that I didn't have to go around, but it's probably just a dead end or roof is now. Dee -dee -dee. So, I, I swear I can hear a scratching, but... I don't remember there being a... Is there one in here? Yeah, this is the cell you get thrown in if you get caught. No, it can't be. I don't know what that was, I just... Could have sworn I heard a scratching. Oh well. Now that we're members... Hey, newcomer. Hey, newcomer. Okay, I've got to go up the gate. Up the ladder. I know I know we need this gate open. Hey rookie, are you going into the desert? 
I'll open this gate for you, but you can't cross the desert unless you pass the two trials. The first trial is the River of Sand. You can't walk across this river. After you cross it, follow the flags we place there. The second trial is the Phantom Guide. Those without eyes that can see the truth will only find themselves returning here. You are going anyway, aren't you? I won't stop you. Go ahead. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so we need the lens of truth and the hook shot, a uh, long shot. Okay. Here we go. Between the flags. <laughs> that was a great start. Okay, no. That's more like it. Oh yeah, the carpet merchant guy. Forgot about him. Uh, yeah, no. I actually can't remember what he sells. Do we need hover boots to get there? I don't know. Oh well. Let's just carry on. Can't be that important. I'm going to see if I can change it to daytime. I think it's because it's night time. I can't see anything. Oh, okay. It's a reset one. Damn. I thought it was just past time. Never mind. Yeah, I can see a lot clearer now anyway. <laughs> I've done it again. Take two. Take three. Take whatever. Okay. Stop doing that. Stop. At least we get the music. I like the music. Okay, I can see a little better. Not much, but a little better. Goal. Yeah, there is something down here. Overkill. Meh. That's all.
Yeah, you can hear the ghost already. <clears throat> oh, for peace sake. If the text is open, you can't use this lens. Remember, you can flicker the lens to save on mana. Magic if you need to. <laughs> Doesn't spook easily, does it? Hey, what's that over there? Hmm. I shouldn't get distracted. <laughs> you let me into a trap! Oh, that's how we're going in here anyway, it's a box. If I remember, you can use those boxes as like a landmark to get here without the lens. And where the enemies spawn as well, I'm guessing. Because it seems every time the enemies spawn, you have to change direction. <laughs> I don't know, I've never done this without doing it this way, so I wouldn't know if that works. And we've arrived! First stop, this side. Hang on. How lazy is that? They literally don't have they literally didn't bother to make coconuts, they just put deku nuts in a tree. Should we have a coconut tree? What's a coconut? Uh I don't know, what nuts do we have? Yeah, you can't even knock them out. <laughs> they literally just put deku nuts as coconuts. Hoping that no one would notice. The second to last fairy fountain. There's only one more after this one. And it's right at the end of the game. Welcome, Sly. I am the Great Fairy of Magic. I will give you a magic spell. Please take it. Yeah, soon we don't have to look at these ones any at these fairies anymore. You got Nehru's love. Cast this to create a powerful protective barrier. It's defensive magic you can use with C. Yeah, we can now become invincible at will. <laughs> Only for a limited time, so use it carefully. When battle is made, you wear it. Blah, blah, blah. So we now have Nehru's love. <coughs> Which is basically invincibility. Yeah, this is OP as hell. Oh, actually. Save a bit of cleanup again. I remember this tree's got something. I remember you used to, like, bomb the oasis, because I thought that did something, but it doesn't. Can't feel it. Yeah, I remember that there's something here. Yeah, shut up. I know about Nocturne of Shadow, but I'm not doing Nocturne of Shadow, am I? 
battery. I remember that the only real downside to Nero's love is you can't use any other source of magic while it's active. That's the only real downside to it, so you can't use like fire arrows. Anyway, time to do something that's completely useless, and then we learn it's completely useless, and then we can move on with our lives. I think we're running out of encounters with Sheik at this point. Past, present, future. The Master Sword is a ship with which you can sail upstream and downstream through Time's River. And yeah, the owl's there, which kind of kills the whole theory of Rauru being the owl. The port for that ship is in the Temple of Time. To restore the Desert Colossus and enter the Spirit Temple, you must travel back through Time's flow. Listen to this requiem of spirit. This melody will lead a child back to the desert. Quite literally. Because we use it to get child link here. Disguising my yawn. I'm playing my own song, Screw You Sheep. Because yeah, I used to think like the theory was Rauru was Kipora Gaboa, the owl, but <clears throat> with Rauru kind of being a, a dead spirit in the future and Kipora being here in the future. Whereas I think this is the only time you see the owl as an adult. I don't remember it being anywhere else as an adult. It's very much just been there while you were a child. Yes, yeah, spirit temples are weird. So yeah, basically you find out you can't make any progress here without doing the child section first. So, that's this part done. We reached the spirit temple, cleared Budo Fortress, grabbed Nehru's love, and a few sculptures as well. So yeah, uh, see you next part where it's either going to be Shadow Temple or um, Spirit Temple Child half. Probably Spirit Temple Child seeing as we're here. Because we've got like all the songs now. Yep, yeah. so see you there.